Hi guys, good morning. This is Prem Rose and welcome back to my channel. Um, I haven't been on for a while because I was suffering from some kind of skin allergy and I actually stayed at the hospital for a few days and I am now back. I am still a bit swollen in my face but I am getting there and um, I hope you are all doing well. And today, I wanted to share with you my rescued ferns. I have them for about two months now. And I got these um, plants from my local supermarket. And they were actually dying. And I never thought that it would be so easy to rescue ferns. And um, I got them for about 50 pens which is really good and I never thought that they were they would survive anyway um, so this one here it's looking so lush and um, I have this another small one here and look at the variegation and the leaves of this one And this one is not a rescued plant. I bought it for a full price. This is my maiden hair fern and his it has grown so much since I first got it. And um, down there I have a couple more rescued ferns. So that one is just beginning to bounce back. And this one is doing very well. Um, so in my last houseplant tour, um, this space here was filled with um, a lot of orchids and uh, most of them I have thrown them away because I have been trying to nurse them back to health for over six months and um, they were not just doing so well for me after the cinnamon powder accident. And that's why I have decided to just get rid of them because uh, they were beginning to attract a lot of mealy bugs as well. And um, they are doing very well because I think it's also because of the amount of sunlight that they are getting around this time of year. And also... I found out, I discovered that they do so well if they um, are placed on top of a gravel with a bit of water at the bottom to keep them, um, to give them enough humidity. Um, I'm, I am getting into ferns this year, so I think in winter time I will consider giving this space here a bit of a supplemental light. Um, as you can see, it's not very far from uh, my south facing window but I have a lot of plants there as well. And by mid afternoon we don't get uh, any uh, direct sunlight from there, so from this window, from this south facing window, so um, the ferns are not getting enough in the afternoon, so I would really consider giving them supplemental light in winter time, I think. And I hope they will stay lush all year round, and as you can see, my begonia there is getting so huge. And um, just a little update since we are already here and I miss my plants so much when I was at the hospital. So this is my um, Clevia Miniata. So this spring it did not bloom for me but look at this guys. It's giving me two babies. See? And uh, my succulents are sunbathing. The 
this morning. So I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. You take care. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you so much for watching.